Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Today I'll be unboxing the Transformers Movie 35th Anniversary Limited Edition 4K Steelbook by Shout Factory. But before we begin, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get to it. Let's start off by taking a look at the 20th Anniversary Special Edition DVD that was released in 2006 by Sony BMG. Disc 1 includes a 16x9 widescreen version of the movie and a ton of extras, such as the Autobot Matrix of Knowledge which includes fun facts and trivia, audio commentaries, video gallery which includes the original trailer and TV spots, a photo gallery, and the Scramble City episode which was only aired in Japan, as well as the sneak peek of the 2007 live action movie. Disc 2 includes a full screen version of the movie. Autobot City Trivia Game, Featurettes, a video gallery, and animated storyboards. As mentioned earlier, the Scramble City episode was only aired in Japan and it bridges the gap between the Season 2 of the G1 Transformers and the movie. This episode introduces a lot of the characters from the movie. To be honest, I haven't watched all the bonus content in the DVD, but it's pretty cool to have in a collection. This is the 35th anniversary limited edition 4K Steelbook by Shout Factory. It comes with 4 exclusive cards and bonus features. I've displayed the artwork for the regular release on the left for comparison. The front of the steelbook displays Rodimus Prime holding the Matrix and the Transformers movie logo. Time to open it up and have a look inside. But first, let's have a quick look at the bonus features. You get the new 4K restoration, new feature length storyboards, new 2016 private acoustic performance by Stan Bush, Till All or One, a comprehensive documentary looking back at the Transformers the movie with members of the cast and crew, audio commentary with director Nelson Shin, featurettes, storyboards, and trailers and TV spots. The back of the steelbook displays Galvatron and the phrase Beyond Good, Beyond Evil, Beyond Your Wildest Imagination. Inside, there's a black envelope containing the four cards and the two discs. The artwork inside of the steelbook displays Unicron. The first disc is the full frame Blu-ray. The second disc is the widescreen 4K UHD and displays Rodimus Prime holding the Matrix. It would have been nice if they had included a digital copy of the movie with this release. The design on the first disc is the time tunnel effect seen in the intro of the movie. Now let's take a look at the cards. The first one is Rodimus Prime holding the Matrix. The second one is Optimus Prime. The third is Unicron. And the fourth is Megatron. Thanks for watching. Autobots, transform! <laughs>